My name's Nick Barnett, I'm the Grounds Manager for Cranny Parish Council um, and I'm also the Joint Project Manager for the Cranny Play Park. In this section of the playground at present, um, the toddler zone is being constructed. Um, it's coming into its final phases now and hopefully within the next sort of two to three weeks um, we will have the area open for use. At the moment the workmen are working on the sandworks um, construction which is a very tactile piece of play equipment um, which enables the children to play within the sand that is surrounding it. Um, pulling with pulleys and shovels, moving the sand about the structure. Originally we had a playground here, a very small playground, and the parish council decided that they wanted to expand it. We've worked with Waverley Borough Council to do this, and we got £50,000 worth of big lottery funding to, to help us on our way. The whole project will cost around £125,000, but by working with the local community, with other agencies and our own in-house staff, we've managed to get the cost down quite significantly and so the whole project is going to take five years but actually we've finished almost three quarters of it within uh, only nine months which is, is really good going and that's with help from the Action for Cranley Play Park Association and with help from the Rotary Club and other people who've um, donated money to us which is really good. It's been uh, constructed in four different phases according to age group so we have the existing playground, which will be used and, and incorporated into the main playground. We've got a toddler zone, which is being constructed behind me here. We've got another zone here, which is going to be for the older over nines children. And then we have a teen zone, which has got a meeting point and tr trim trail type equipment. In actual fact, it isn't going to ever be completed because it's a living project. So although we will have finished the original plans, there will be always room for more things to be going in and more things to be happening. This is a living project. I know there has been some concerns from some users of the park that um, there is risks involved with the use of this particular piece of equipment. Uh, we have done, undertaken a lot of research with regard to the risk benefit values of all of the equipment within the park. Um, and these particular pieces of um, equipment that are behind me here have been evaluated after a, you know, a long period of time of studying this research. Current thinking is that um, introducing managed risk into play facilities is to the benefit of child development. It's obviously something that we will monitor um, and regularly get feedback from and obviously if, there, if it, it does become a major issue then it's something that we may have to readdress.